Annyeong everyone, thank you for watching this video. Today I'm going to be presenting to you the 2021 new N-Series Smooth. Now there's a reason why it is smooth and that is because of the transmission. And we will find out in the driving session why it has smooth. Thank you for watching and in our channel we say, Shijak. Isuzu Philippines is the number one truck brand for the past 21 years here in the Philippines. And it is one of the best or best truck brands in the world. It is even found in Korea. That's cool, you know how Koreans are very picky. This is a perfect truck if you are having trouble with manual transmission. And I'm going to show you why this truck performs unlike a manual transmission and i know many of you want a diesel truck that has a manual transmission so that it will have less maintenance but this one according to isuzu will change just that this is the dimension of the new n-series the n-series smooth comes with a 3.0 liter blue power euro 4 turbo intercooler engine that does about 91 horsepower and 354 newton meters of torque and it is mated to a an automated manual transmission or also called as smooth the isuzu n-series smooth comes with drum braking system and it also comes with auxiliary braking system called exhaust brakes the exhaust brake is like engine braking in your passenger cars it also has a separate stock so that you can turn it on and off depending on the situation and how much load you have on the road. For the suspension, it has multi-lift springs for the front and the back. For the tire size, it has a 7.50-15 LT. The Isuzu N-Series Smooth comes with plenty of types and it starts from 1,600,000 pesos SRP and it will actually increase depending on your need let me first show you the lighting system yes halogen or bulb type with multi-reflector huge and functional let me show you the back there you go boxy type of tail lamp and for your plate number let us start from the front fascia i like what i'm seeing here yes the side mirrors are not really on the side but on the corner including this one so it will show the front end look at this huge very intimidating headlamp with huge reflectors maybe an option for your fog lamp if you want to install one a place for your tow hook or recovery hook look at this design that you can actually find in dmax or mu nl smoother this is like nl 85 so yeah blue power euro 4 euro 4 euro 5 those are the things i like more space for your air to come inside then the underside the air spot and everything is there from the side huge windows now this left side doesn't have the front mirror that is expected look at this the turn signal huge as well there's a reflector and a heavy duty step board i really like the feeling of me pulling this one it is very sturdy this is the lever yes. to actually make the head fold you have to pull three things at the same time three things at the same time yes. no that wow oh oh ah and if you want to put it back push it yes yeah. for safety okay Wow, this is the engine block <laughs> for JJ1E4NC. This is Euro 4. The fan. This is 
Amazing. So this is the firewall. It's gonna stop Reagan's balls from boiling. Diba? Oh, and then to put it down, just so to put it down, okay, just make sure your head will not get stuck. Pull down. Pull up. Oh 91 horsepower and 354 newton meters of torque. The battery is here. Heavy metal. The rear wheel. Gets exciting is uh, this one, the spare wheel, and uh, the body is coming from Centro, so it is heavy duty even for the tail lamp. If you guys enjoyed the video of Soju Cars on this N series truck, head over to my channel and watch my video as well. Let's do this! Woo! And that's a lot of place to load with heavy duty flooring as well. Now that's the exterior, but there's also something like this. Now on this side is where you have the huge gas tank or diesel tank. Only diesel guys, don't use other stuff. So that's the exterior. Now let me show you the interior really quick. Oh, the radio antenna is here. Let's enter, we'll open the door, yeah, so this is how it looks like, of course it is all in durable hard plastic, but look at this, powered windows with auto for the driver, and this grab handle is doing wonders, especially when you want to close the door and stuff, so that's really cool, door bin, nice speaker, big grab handle or door handle, the step board, it's made of plastic, but it looks very rugged. There you go. Some warning. For your tire pressure. There you go, front and rear. So before we enter, look at this area right here. It doesn't have a clutch anymore. OBD. And this, you see this? This is the lever for you to adjust the steering wheel, but it is telescopic. So that is fantastic. The choke is here. Plenty of buttons, blanks. And look at the seat. Perforated, very cushiony, really soft. Yeah, and it can be reclined and also adjusted. For you to climb in, just hold on to this. And we are inside. For you to close, reach for this. And mind you, there is an ashtray. There you go. Now this is the start of the ELF. <laughs> this is the start of the N-Series. And you know, naturally, I was shaking this, forgetting that this is an automated manual transmission. So let's start. There, that's how quiet it, it is inside. There you go. Let's turn on the light. Oh, I like the background. <laughs> Oh, I like the backlight. Yeah, it shows white and yellow or orange here, red here. The steering wheel is in plastic or urethane. No airbag, but that's a huge uh, horn. Let's hear the sound. Okay, the horn needs to be updated. It needs more grunt. Manual stock for the lighting system. Manual stock for the wiper you can put it down for the exhaust braking lots of blanks so you can customize this heavily <laughs> one din radio with SD card and USB and aux the air condition oh yeah the air condition is fantastic 12 volt more blanks with fast and slow adjustment there is also an emergency button for the truck to be saved in case of emergency. There's a hook for you to hang something, maybe plastic bag. But look at this. Cup holders. Two of them. Compartment, compartment. Everything here is hard plastic. But I like this one. There you go. See that? That is great. 
and here this is where the fuses are so yeah and this is the automated manual transmission RND and manual mode with echo so echo echo so it drives most probably like an automatic vehicle there you go handbrake the sun visors are huge there's one thing I noticed with the sun visor it is a bit difficult to remove because the hook is going downwards so you need to put it down like that huge space I wish this was extending so for you to store it you have to do it the other way a standard room mirror that you cannot see anything behind because there is an aluminum uh, van or cargo area right there so yeah and this is how it sounds like there you go there's a very tiny uh, screen for your auto trip meter and the gear status so let's drive the truck already let's go this is the second biggest vehicle that I have driven in the YouTube channel this is the new Isuzu N-Series Smooth Smooth because it has the automatic manual transmission This is a manual that shifts automatically When you put it to drive, it starts at second gear It starts at second gear And if you want to start at first gear You need to press the first gear button here right below the big gear lever button there is a tiny screen right here in the instrument cluster that shows the gear shifting and as of now I'm in echo mode yes this N series comes with echo mode <laughs> visibility it's like you're in a fish tank you have all the view that you need huge side mirrors and I'm already forgetting that I'm driving a truck because the multi lift springs are doing really well and more if you have lots of load now the trucks are transitioning more and more you are getting creature comforts like for me this is already a creature comfort the air condition and this one yeah a lot of things happening guys in Isuzu you can actually have fun in driving a truck so Isuzu being number one for the past 21 years and still going they are specialists now this 3.0 liter turbocharged intercooled CRDI blue power Euro 4 engine gets the job done now the cabin noise not so bad considering the engine is right behind right below and behind your butt so this is cool guys now there's a room mirror but you cannot use it because this one has an aluminum band behind it so let's try to accelerate from 20 we're in normal mode drive starts at second gear press it 20 third gear 40 now the speed limit here is 40 so that's how quick it was to reach 40 fantastic there's nothing shaking unless there's something maybe loaded that is not fixed properly as of now the seats are so comfortable the steering is also very soft this is a telescopic steering wheel but with, with this kind of <laughs> horn so maybe you can upgrade that this is a cool uh, truck for your negocio this one starts at 1.6 million that's the one without an aircon so if you think you don't need an aircon that's where you can start this transmission it will uh, save you about 70,000 pesos over six years for the transmission because you don't have to worry about your driver riding on the clutch right so this is definitely a good and a comfortable even non-pro can drive this one yes unless uh, 
you are going to use it for your commercial use. So yeah, Isuzu Philippines uh, really make trucking also convenient. So go to the nearest Isuzu dealership and try it out. Going over the humps. Boom. Not bad. When you pass the second gear and the third gear, you can really feel the control that you can have with the accelerator. Having no clutch in this kind of truck, <laughs> it feels weird. It's my first time to drive a truck that doesn't have a clutch, which means you don't have to start with the clutch and your left leg will be saved for your drivers. <laughs> this is as easy as driving a van. Okay, here we go. This is the last hurrah. Yeah. The shifting, the shifting is not brutal, but it is smooth. It is smooth. It's smoother than you do it manually. So, better get your hands on this, babies. Thank you for watching this video. I will see you in the next video. May your dreams come true. Annyeong!